Just assume that anyone who's uh, who's been a participant in one of these debates, and I keep saying I'm not moderating, CNN's moderating, I want to make sure everyone, is, and I don't know who the moderator is, but I think we get all access passes to the convention as well and tickets to the Brown Super Bowl game. But those other debates, uh, the first one's Fox in, in the summertime, you got at least seven others. Have you already figured out who the other conservative media partners are, writes Priebus, or is that still a work in progress? It's still a work in progress. The, the Salem piece... I've been all over for a year and a half, so that was my the first thing I wanted to make sure happened. And so the, all the other announcements will be coming, and we're working with other conservative outlets as well to make more announcements. So we will live up to our promise to our supporters and people out there that agree with us that we are going to have a, a reasonable debate process that will include people who actually give a darn about our party in the process. And so today is the first step in the right direction. So I got to ask today, last question. I think it was Dylan Byers. It might have been Dave Weigel about the the rights reforms. I said there's the moving up the convention. There's the ordering of the primary calendar. There's the changing of the debate format to both be compressed and add conservative voices. Of those three big rights reforms, which one do you think is most significant? I think controlling the debates. Um, I think having having control over the debates so that we don't turn this into a 23 debate circus in front of people who don't care at all about the party but only care about making news for themselves. I think that's number one. No, then number two is the compression on the calendar so that we don't have a six-month uh, slice and dice festival in our party. And so when do you expect the last state to make up its mind about the scheduling of their primary? That's got to be done fairly soon, isn't it? Well, they have until October uh, under the rule, so a lot of states are moving around. My suspicion, though, is that there's going to be a big date on March 1st. There'll be a big winner-take-all date on March 15th. I think the next Tuesday after that will also be significant. But my guess is that two-thirds of all the delegates will be allocated before the end of March. That's big news. Ryan Priebus, always a pleasure to talk to you, Mr. Chairman. Look forward to uh, being a participant in the second debate, the one at the Reagan Presidential Library, moderated by CNN. Thank you so much, Mr. Chairman. I'll be right back, America. It's the Hugh Hewitt Show. It's the Hugh Hewitt Show. It's the Hugh Hewitt Show.